new morning and we're in serious need of some iron ore and now that we have a handy dandy bronze pick we can actually go get some yes I know you want my brains they're tasty and taste good with milk and you're dead again I know I never actually noticed this water source right here I can probably use that to plant some I tried to harvest it. All right, well, what we need to do today is collect some iron, which actually I think there was some down here, wasn't there? No, that's copper. I'll get into a lot of that anyway. All right, so let's go ahead. We're gonna collect some iron during the day. Probably should get some food too, which I didn't bring with me, of course. Why would I do that? Let me grab it before I get too far. I'm notorious about forgetting the food. Okay, here we are, we're in. Put this away, put that away, put that away. Grab food. Looks like this is gonna be my only food. Where's... One, two, three, four, five, that should be enough. I'll put this away. As you see, I still have my render distance set to normal because apparently this mod pack is pretty graphic intensive and this is my best frame rate because I don't think anybody enjoys watching it be all choppy. I know I don't enjoy it. Hey, Mr. Bat. Alright. So we're going to go ahead and go in this cave here. Ah, oh, here's some nice iron ore here. Now let's check and make sure this works. Yes, we has iron. And because I don't want to waste the non-iron, the non-bronze pick. Let's see what we got here, oh, more iron. Oh, wait, more iron. Oh, goody, goody iron. All right, so we're doing pretty well actually. We're finding surprisingly large amounts of iron. Okay, not really seeing anything bad coming around, so we're gonna keep on working. Yep, that's what I thought, one's hiding. Go ahead and grab this copper, because we're gonna need even more bronze than we have been collecting. Oops. So let's just go ahead and grab some more iron got 20 now, but just for the sake of argument, let's go ahead and get as much as we can collect right now. Okay, nothing here. Pretty sure, yep, there was some here. Wow, we're actually, I think this is very lucky of us to find so much iron in one place. Alright, now you would think, yay, you can get iron, that means you can actually get into the real tools now. Well, there's a few steps I'm going to have to do before I get that far. Like, number one, you have to make a, well, first you, okay, let me see if I get this straight. First we have to update the bloom we've got, because we can't smelt iron in this kind of a bloom. Let's see what we got here. All right, that's looking a little bit more dangerous than I want to deal with right now. It's not that I'm a coward, it's just that I'm still unarmored. Cool. Oops. 
Sorry, folks. Have an itch right next to the microphone. And we will collect as much coal as we can get, because we're going to need tons of it. Making the kinds of iron that we are all familiar with, that lovely whitish silver kind, requires both coal and iron ore. And we will require a copper bloom, which of course requires that you make lots of, or sorry, a bronze, what is it called, a bronze, yeah, it's a copper bloom and a bronze anvil. Okay. Keep on mining, keep on mining. But yes, by the end of this episode, we should be to iron. Provided nothing horrible happens. Famous last words. Oh, fire infused, okay. Well, here's some, ah, we're not going to do with coal right now. Alright, so we're doing well. Doing quite well. Ooh. Ooh. How do I get down there without hurting myself? Um, I guess I'm mining this way. That was surprisingly easy. Okay, let's start marking this area. That's mine, that's mine, that's mine. I don't know if you all have ever watched Red Dwarf, but Cat has this little spray bottle, spray stuff going like, this is mine, and that's mine, and that's mine. He is a funny character. The whole thing is a comedy, but of course, he happens to be one of my favorites. He doesn't even try to pretend to be selfless. He is what he is, and he has no shame whatsoever. Not that I try to emulate that, but I just think that's hilarious. I've known far too many people like that, so the fact that one of them is immortalized in this fashion is just too rich. More iron. Alright, so here we are. Oh, even more iron. I'm doing pretty, I'm doing very, very well. I must say, I'm being extraordinarily lucky at the moment. I say that and suddenly a creeper comes up behind me and goes here. Um, hello. That's actually not what I wanted to do. That's what I wanted to do. So we are going to mine up a ton of iron. The stack is good. No, I'm not going to collect that copper right now. Oh boy, wow, look at all this. Did they increase the iron ore distribution in this mod pack? Because this is a lot more iron than I ever remember seeing in normal. Because there have been times where I was starved for iron. Okay. Keep on collecting. Alright. I need iron. Okay, nothing coming. And collect this. Oops. Yes, mining is not terribly exciting to watch, but it's one of those necessary parts of the game now, isn't it? Alright, so we're going to go ahead and stop here. I think it's about time to start heading home. Actually, let me check the time of day, because... Evening. Where's the house? I always get lost when I come out of this entrance. I think it's this way. I should probably put a dirt pole in the house. So I can, ooh. Hmm, okay. So I can see it from a greater distance. I haven't seen that large friend of mine return, which is something I'm actually pleased about, since he did not look like he was be terribly friendly. Hmm. 
as long as it's daytime, I'm going to go ahead and try. Yeah, so if I dig this water, and then I can have it run. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. It should come to here. Nope, not quite. So how far does it go? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven from the source. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We're going to go ahead and clear out this because we have to have the water on similar level. Ah, uh, shoot, ran out of shovel. Oh well, looks like the sun's about to go down anyway. Alright, let's go ahead and put stuff away. Now that we have iron, let's go ahead and start some of this cooking. Coal, charcoal, that's what I need. Alright, you. Put those two in there. Uh, is that not what I need to do? Uh, well, cook what you want. Put this in here. Yeah, that didn't actually do anything. Oh good, food out of here. That'll use three of those. Yeah, I'll leave that like that. Well, here's to a hard day's work. Ah. Let's see. I guess I'll just sit on that amount of food for right now. Alright, so what do we got going on? Get this. And I'll need... Because I need bronze. How much bronze do I have in here already? I only have four hot bronze. Let's see, I'm going to need these tools. See, what else will I need? See, I have some steel, but I'm trying intentionally not to use this. Just so I can show you guys how to do this. Um, yeah, we'll leave that alone for now. Need to make more bronze. Come on, give me seven. There we go. We're going to come over here. Put these in. Turn this into more bronze. Hey dude. I heard you. Hey Mr. Creeper. See, they can't see me. I'm invisible. Okay. How's this coming along? Okay, we got six. Now we're going to need a ton of this. Just to point it out, Seeing something, oh, okay, this is particles from that. On this anvil, we're gonna have to set up so that top three, this block of four, this block of four are all hot bronze, and then there's gonna have to be a bronze block here. So that's what, four, eight, 11, plus nine, that's 20 bronze total. And I'm sitting on 14 total. So yeah, I need, oh, actually 18 total. Oh well, this should actually make this a little bit easier. Almost ready for it. Here we go. Let's go ahead and put these in. And we will get what we need. Now, let's go ahead and make the bronze block. So we're going to need that. We're going to need a bloom, which, whoops, not that one require one of this and a ton of cobble. Let's go ahead and make this. Because we're going to need... I'm going to leave the old bloom just because. So we have two of those. We need four of these. And oh yeah, we're going to need some copper, aren't we? Okay. How's this coming along? 15, 17. Alright, so we are good. Let's go ahead and drop this into the forge. 
Um, kind of need a fuel source. I don't want to have to use that. Um, take these. Take that. And drop those in here. Because this will turn these into the hot iron. Or hot, what's this? Hot bronze. Which is amazing, because this has been hot bronze for over a day now. <laughs> it's kind of interesting that it doesn't cool down. Okay. Apparently this lasts a pretty good long while. So, let's see. We'll see if it actually goes up in temperature. Hey there. Hey, dude. All right, don't wander around so much. All right, we need to make the copper block again. There's your block of copper. Oops, not there. Here. And two of those. So there's another bloom. Now we can't make... Is that done yet? Ten. I need one more. Come on. There we go. Eleven. Oh, hey. You can't shoot me. That's so cool. Yeah, just sit there and waste ammo. Alright. So here we got this. Then we have this. Then we have that. And this is how you make this. This should make the sound like you're beating on a ghast. Yep. Now generally the best way to do it is to count to three. Blank. One, two, three. One, two, three. And you'll see that it does progress fairly. It's not fast. One, two, three. Wow, I'm going to have so many arrows over there where that Mr. Skeleton is. But the good news is that he can't shoot. Can you? You can't shoot me. Yes, you can. Well, I stand corrected. So I need, guess I should probably dig that out a little bit better over there. I wonder if I can smack him in the head. Nope. Let's see, how is this coming along? As you can see, it takes a long time to do this. This is my first time ever progressing this far into this mod pack, so we're all learning. I don't know if it matters which side of the block you hit. In fact, I may actually go through one entire hammer here. But we're going to give it a shot. Wow, it takes a long time. I said we were going to get through it in this episode, but uh, the way this is going... Urgh. Urgh. Yeah. It's working. It's not fast. have to go for more uh, wood the next day just so I can go ahead and get more charcoal. And I don't want to use coal. Coal is so valuable just to make the uh, iron. Okay, wow. This is a very slow process. Not at all exciting at all, is it? Most excitement we had was whenever the skeletons were shooting at us. And he got bored already. Hmm. Hey guy, I'm over here. Can you shoot me? Yoo-hoo. <coughs> I'm taking this out on you. See? <coughs> Imagine that that... Is your face. <laughs> See that? That's your face. <laughs> Take that. Wow. I've been at this just about all night. And I still don't have... It's almost done. I need a copper bloom. Then I start making the 
iron. And yeah, that should be okay. Come on. Let's see. Yeah. This looks to be pretty safe. He doesn't seem like he can hit me. Oh, well, maybe I stand corrected. Ow. Okay, now he's falling down. Yep, now you're on fire. Sucks to be undead, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. Sucks to be undead. <laughs> I don't know, I find it funny just to watch them run around as if to go, oh, help me, help me. Oh, well, it's it's now the next day, so I guess technically I should end, even though I'm so close. Look at that. Okay, we're gonna get, at least get through this. I'm gonna prepare the... Okay, I'm not going to prepare the copper bloom. I will be back on day nine. And we should finish this up then. In any event, I hope you all have had a pleasant evening. Good night.